Well, it's a gathering aimed at building new co collaborations, connections, and opportunities. Today was the 14th annual TEDx Detroit, where I had the chance to share my story of mentorship with yeah. someone that all of us recognized very well. Here's Fox 2's Ingrid Kelly. It's the place where um, technology, entertainment, um, design collide in the form of speakers, entertainment. <laughs> It's called TEDx Detroit, and this year's event brought out some Fox 2 talent, past and present. That's retired Fox 2 anchor Ewell Perkins and current Fox 2 anchor Root Raj taking the stage to share an important story. That begins with hope and ends with pure joy. And at the center of it all is a friendship that these broadcasters share that formed when one took the hand of the other to be his mentor. You know, I think it's important to encourage young people to live out their dreams. The minute I made the brunch, I could tell that his desire to become a broadcast journalist was strong, although he was just a teenager. I was 14 years old. I looked around and I didn't see any Indian Americans that looked like me, that were on television, that were doing the news. But as this teen did a cable access show in his hometown of Troy, he reached out to one of Detroit's celebrated anchors for guidance. Finally, in 1991, I met Jewel Perkins and he became a face that I recognized because mentorships, my friend, it's about a mutual understanding. It's about feeling close enough with somebody to be vulnerable and ask for help. And that's who Jewel was to me. Hugh Perkins and Root Raj being a part of this is amazing. And, and then to see Root Raj take over the position of anchor um, that Hugh held when he retired is an amazing story that we think just needs to be told from the stage and that more people need to hear. From music to speeches, event organizers hope participants walk away inspired. We have some of the most amazing people who are doing some of the most amazing things around the world, and we are changing the world, and it's all from the Detroit area. In Detroit, Ingrid Kelly, Fox. Two news. Oh, I love seeing you two up there, and it's a great story. You know, people see you anchoring in this great position that you've earned. They don't know the backstory and how hard it was to get here and how hard you worked to get here. And it's great to be able to share that friendship with you all and then talk about it on stage. Well, I'm so happy for well, you. Well, me too. And, you know, it, you know, Tara and I have known each other all of our careers for 24, 25 years that mm -hmm. we've worked together from Lansing to Flint. Those journeys to get to these positions can be hard and tough. And, uh, you get a little help along the way from someone like Huel, it certainly means a lot. But it was great to see Huel, by the way. Yeah. He's loving retirement. And by the way, he's just as busy as he was when he was working here. He's out there on the circuit, uh, hanging out, meeting people, golfing, having a great time. What do you think of the one thing, though, that people don't know that they learned from that TED Talk today? Because they can find it online if they look. I think that if the one thing is that mentorships aren't supposed to be planned. You can't just say, okay, now person A, meet person B and become right. a mentor. It has to come from a real desire to want to help someone. And that's what Huel had the entire time along. Yeah.